when the game starts, I'm gonna be like looking at every move like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, don't, don't make mistakes, don't make mistakes. The good thing about traveling is that the players are having more off time on the computer and uh, together. You get to know everyone else a little bit more, a little bit more, make jokes, make, get more comfortable and I think that's especially great for the team building. Because when you go together in the taxi to the airport, on the flight, you're together as a group, you're doing this together. And you change your mindset because you're like, okay, we're on the way to Berlin, it's game time. Welcome here in Berlin Schönefeld. The cabin crew is soon believing their seats to complete. No longer practice in the office. We're going together. We're all getting hyped up. You arrive in Berlin. You wake up the next day and you're ready to go to the studio and play. So the, the first week, uh, how, how I feel it's going to be for the players, it's finally here. They have been since the split ended, thinking about the next split. They have been for the last two months practicing and they cannot wait to get to play. They are all going to be trying to not get nervous because in the end they are going to feel a bit of uh, that spice in the back of their head. When you have to perform, everybody feel anxiety, fear. Is it going to go well? Am I well prepared? Prepared enough? Good enough? We would like to have the answers before we start, but that's impossible. We have to go and do it. And that's actually the, the good thing about being the athlete. You have everything in your two hands. Let it in, it's perfectly normal, but it doesn't have to interfere with your performance during the performance. That is crucial for a good performance. Now what is important is that we go on stage and it's not only about showing what we learn, but that we show that as a team we are able to, we will be able to progress and that we will be able to trust on each other. Trust is a key word for today. Okay? So we all know our responsibilities and we will all be confident on stage. And we will trust on the guy that is on your right and your left will sit. Right? That's the most important for today. So I want to hear it quite loud from our team captain, one, two, three, origin. Hell yeah. I mean, yeah. we have team captain, so. <laughs> get, have... One, two, three, origin! Oh, yeah. gonna be waiting to get into the game to have like the, that one minute of silence before the game starts. When you sit on your computer you already did your picks and band, you already told with the coach, he leaves the stage and then the game is loading and then you hear a bit of background noise because even though the headsets are soundproof you kind of can feel it that there is a crowd watching you. You had nothing to do because the game's loading so maybe you look around you see the people you see a lot of lights and then that's when you get most nervous but as soon as you go to the lane that goes away and you just focus on the game. The LEC match of the week. They keep saying Baron. Dragomir, don't say things like this. First blood goes to upset. Origin are on the board. Kill, 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 kill. Kill him, he's alone, he's alone, he's alone, he's alone. No, Sasha, why are you doing this? He comes up, that's a great interrupt. Nicely done by Selfmade, preventing the engage from Destiny. But it's upset on a rampage with the double. Yeah, it's good upset. Oh, Mitch, so good. Fiori in the 1v2 gets the kill. Jesus Christ, Barn, you got a beast. Erland, you, you went, you went, exactly. That's my shit. Choked out Origin, obliterate Fnatic. So, one, two, three, Origin on your match for your like first time. Or... One, two, three, Origin! Someone of a win, we take it, we take all of them. Yeah, fun. Yeah? Yeah. No, I was really excited and really nervous. It was really <laughs> weird, but I'm glad we won. <laughs> Started on a, on a good win. I like when you told everyone to shut up and listen to each other. <laughs> definitely a great start. Definitely a good start. To something even greater. What's the level difference between LEC and OPL based on your one game played? Yeah, you do. Oh, it's about the same. Like, oh, okay. just clamp Perfect. Start. Cut. Yeah. gather the entire group at the hotel and we just sit down and we just have a talk about everything. You know, everyone can bring up anything they have, if it's good things, bad things, we just kind of like, we, we empty the bag, basically, as a group. Glad everyone like, kept their head in the game and listened to each other. I like Drago's communication earlier a lot and your trust and like, you know. We were listening to each other, we were calm. These guys are 
best friends, colleagues, their team. Then there also uh, uh, another set, another dynamic in the group because they are also rivals. There are the difficult feelings as envy, jealousy, that's in every team. If that's not talked about um, over time, that can build up to fantasies and things like that. That makes it difficult for the team to, to be present in the here now. Everybody's sitting, sitting with, a, with, a, with a feeling that that was okay. I performed well. I did well. The team did well. The further we go on, I would like you to just stay with that feeling just a little bit longer. Everybody here at this tournament, I mean, they are marvelous players. Uh, they, they are athletes on the top level. So it's a mindset, it's a mentality, it's a, it's, it's, it's a mind that decides how, how you control the anxiety, the nervousness and the focus. Even though everyone said really chaotic, everyone talking above each other, doesn't necessarily mean that tomorrow just talk less and, and, and stuff like this. It's, it, it doesn't mean like that, it's more. We'll work on that. Once we have kind of done that, this day and this game is now done. And we don't think about that anymore. Let's go to bed. All right, we're done. <laughs>you see that they are happy and that they're having a good time. It reminds me of when I was playing. In the end, it's their life. They are playing all day and when they go back home, they probably still play more on their computer and they go sleep thinking about the game. When you are able to laugh, when you're able to have fun, when you're able to make jokes, it's so much better because the, the hours just go by and you want to keep playing, you want to keep practicing with your teammates because you're actually enjoying it. When I see that on them, it's, it's really nice because then I, I know that they are not thinking about anything else. I know that they are just enjoying it and I know that they want to keep playing and that's especially what makes me feel the best. Nice last game or last game of our first week. The important part is that we keep the same attitude, we keep the same trust, and we keep the same things, the exact same things that made us one yesterday. Just look at what we did yesterday. We already did, we already left it behind. Now it's just being the moment, being the present, and we control our present and we define our future with knowledge. Okay? That's what we are looking to do today. As Lars says, don't underestimate them. If we do our best, we are gonna win. Alright? One to three Yeah. On Elias. One, two, three, Origin! So next for Origin, win or lose actually doesn't matter in the early parts of the season. All you care about when you look forward is how many things can we actually work on and improve. The entire goal for the first couple of weeks is just to figure out what is the right identity and model for our team. OG versus Schalke. A new duck! That was incredible! Leaps forward. Dream's gonna get taken down as well. And it that's my Mitch. That's why we got him. That's my Mitch. That's the stuff. Flash body slam and it instead everything kicks off. Absolute escalation. Nice, good move. And that's going to be a 2 0 start for this OG lineup. One, two, three, four, five. I think winning worlds is, of course, like a goal that everyone has, like everyone likes winning. But especially will be to be the brand that we were uh, when we started in 2015. We grew up very fast and then we had a rough time as well in which we dropped a lot and a lot of fans lost hope on us. They didn't think that we would come back at all and I think that's something that I personally I would like to see again. The fans believing in us again like they did in those first years. I remember the support we had was insane and then now when we started Origin again that you could see a grasp of what it was and I think that that's pretty much the goal that we should all have here, to have the fans believing in us and living our brand again like they did in the past.